first time. They can't wait. In just moments, the harp seals on this Charlestown beach will waddle 30 feet to freedom. They haven't been this close to the ocean since their rescue along nearby beaches a few months ago. And these are animals that have come in uh, emaciated. They're very hungry. They're weak. They have infections. Sick and unable to make it on their own, they ended up here at Mystic Aquarium's Institute for Exploration, like these pups. Staff members nurse the mammals back to health, helping them build up their strength so they can make it on their own. While these seals are rehabilitating here at Mystic Aquarium, they get a strong dose of tough love. Their contact with humans is kept to a bare minimum, and for good reason. We would prefer that they, they keep the wild in them, and that they'll, when they go back into the wild, they will go off and live a normal wild life without having to interact with people and look to people for food. Because of that, the seals are not hand-fed. Instead, staff members quickly toss fish through a side door. These animals have to learn to associate fish with water and catching it on their own. You ready? Yes. It all leads up to this day. There you go. <laughs> when the pups are well enough to go home. That's, that's what we're all about. About giving these seals the strength they need to head back to their natural habitat. It's amazing. Where do you think they're going? Well, they're probably going to be moving around up and down the coast. They're looking for places to rest and to eat. Before heading up north, back home to Canada for the summer. Karen Southern, 12 News.